Welcome to my channel Christina's World. For this work of art we will need red tie or red paper, face paints and this black hat on which we stick leaves from apple tree and a blazer. First I'm going to apply some foundation to make my skin more even, but you're welcome to skip this. Now I'm applying some fixing powder. And to make my lips lighter, I'm applying very, very light shade of a lipstick. We are going to need white, black, and green colors. <laughs> Draw the apple shape with a white color first. Once you've finished, you can start filling. I started the filling with white to be able to create 3D effect later on and also to make the green color a bit lighter. However, I'm not sure if the colors need it to be wet. I definitely recommend you those which come from with a brush. What a beauty! Now we can start drawing and filling with a green color. Lastly, we use black color to shape the apple a little bit. Because I don't want the black lines to be too sharp, I will blend them in with the old beauty blender. To make the green more intense, we are going to apply green eyeshadow too.
Time to time you can add black eyeshadow to make it more 3D. Now when we are finished with the shading, we can go around the apple with the green pen again to make it more sharp. Time to change! If you like me don't have red tie, it's fine, just cut one out of a red paper and pin it to your shirt. Tie your hair back like a gentleman. Whoops! Now we can pin some more leaves to your hair so they can pop out underneath the hat. Put your hat on. And we're good to go! What do you think? Do I look like a son of man? Thanks for watching, enjoy Halloween, bye!